on to my Saggies. So you have the Temperance, which is Sagittarius out of the Major Arcana. So the first freaking card out of this new batch and you have your own Major Arcana. So you have the uh, Temperance, right? The Temperance and the Four of Cups. So this right here is about how you Sagittarius, um, you're, you're making wiser decisions about the quality of the people that you keep around you. Um, there's very much so you Sagittarius paying attention to if you approach somebody and you're trying to talk to them and get to know them, are they going to allow you to get to know you or are they going to give you a difficult time? If they give you a difficult time, then I honestly see the Seven of Cups, which is you will begin to talk to other people because you Sagittarius, uh, you have no time for the nonsense. You have no time for it. Um, ultimately, right, the Four of Cups, you want to make sure that a person is trust uh, trustworthy. Like it is, I said before, a lot of times people will try to play games on a Sagittarius, on y'all, right? Both sides, you know what I mean? I've seen it personally myself on both sides and people will take advantage of you if they can. Um, so you have to learn to not allow those people to do that. And how you do that is by paying attention, right? Because people put way too much hypotheticals. And what I mean by that is they're telling you that they're not wasting your time or they're trying to act like they're not wasting your time, but then they're gaslighting you and trying to make it seem like, no, you're the one that's wasting time and all of this stuff is your fault, your problem, you're the issue when that's not true, right? Um, what it is is, is that you Sagittarius, you're not really wasting their time. They're wasting yours, but the way that they're trying to play it off like is you're wasting their time and that you're the one that's really serious. <laughs> And how can they take you seriously? Because um, you Sagittarius don't take yourself seriously because you need to do better. But then at the same time, the warped part of it is they do like you. But they won't allow themselves to be with you because, no, they, they need they need better. Right. On both sides, they need better. Right. So in other words, trying to change people for the streets on one side trying to change people for the streets to stay at home. On the other side, trying to get, trying to convince people to do better, say better, talk about it. You know what I mean? When in actuality, you know good and well that all of that is a scam anyway, because they're just trying to look for you. They're just trying to look to you to do all the heavy lifting and figure everything out while they ride your coattails and have an easier lifestyle. Right. So they want you to change everything about yourself just so that they can have bragging rights and that they can essentially leech up off you. But the seven of cups represents you, Sagittarius. You have, meanwhile, you Sagittarius, we're going to get into it. This is going to be a long video. Meanwhile, you Sagittarius have all the options in the world. You have plenty of options. You do not have to hang around these individuals that are steadily trying to waste your time and play all these games. So even if some of you Sagittarius may be dealing with somebody like this, you Sagittarius are starting to wake up yourselves and realize that you do have options and that you don't have to be around somebody that would ultimately spend all this time every time you try to make a leap of faith with them. They're just trying to make sure that they bring you down. So a lot of you Sagittarius, like I said, starting to wake up and realize that you have options. And then the devil, you're starting to realize that as well. Those same people that you're trying to get to know, some of you, right, who are not giving you attention, who are giving you a difficult time, who are in the, ga in the game, excuse me, who are trying to make you feel a certain kind of way. Those people are ultimately not meant to be trusted. The devil card came up, which means that these people's intentions is to ultimately misuse you. Really, they're trying to misuse you. They're trying to make it so that, you know, they 
control you. They tell you whatever it is that they that they want you to do. They tell you jump and you ask how high. You're going to jump, but you want them to know, but you want them to tell you how much of an effort do you have to put in when it comes to jumping. They, they are a control freak. And for some of you Sagittarius, that X may be good, right? If you know what I mean, that X may be good, but they use that as a means of control or they may look good or there's something attractive about them that you Sagittarius just can't easily shake. But the thing about it is that's the whole point. They're trying to make themselves look that good and that stunning so that very few people can actually be able to get out of their web of lies. If you find value with this, within this reading, then it means it's time for you to come get a personal reading from me. There's a link in the comment section called the link tree. Click on it. It will redirect you to a website in which it has all of the ways you can support me from my Instagram to my Teespring store, which has uh, sweaters, hoodies, T-shirts. Uh, my Amazon, which has my books, as well as uh, my website, which has um, private tarot readings on it, as well as birth chart readings. And if you don't want to go onto my website, you can always contact me, Kareem Spareworks at yahoo.com. Thank you. Um, so there's something irresistible about this person that a lot of people find attractive, and you're attracted to this person. You know, let's not even lie. You're attracted to this person. And this person may have their, their claws in you. This person may have something that tempts you and, and just enraptures you and gets you caught up in how they look or maybe, you know, the ex that, that the two of you have. And there's something hypnotic about this person, right? Animal magnetism. But at the same time, like it is that I said before, they're just trying to control you. So now you have the King of Cups. You have to be able to navigate through that sea of feelings and emotions. Excuse me. Enough for you, Sagittarius, to understand that you have to be able to get out of this one. Because if you do not get yourselves out of this one, the longer you stay with this individual right now, Sagittarius, is the more they are going to get you caught up in their, their, their web of lies and get you more entangled caught up and see that's how a lot of people play games see part of the game part of the whole game is how attractive they are how attractive they are however they are attractive whether it's money whether it's physical looks whatever attracts whatever they 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 brandish right they show whatever it is that they put great emphasis into is what it is that they want people to, to notice about them, to see about them, to understand about them. And when people gravitate to them, they use that to their advantage. That's the reason why it is, like I said before, in the Disney movies, um, I think it was Sleeping Beauty with the, with the witch with the apple. The witch wanted to be the most beautiful individual. Why? Because that was a part of the witch's charm to be able to bring people in with their beauty and remember the two of them was fighting over prince charming right who's gonna get prince charming's attention one of them was using witchcraft right and their physical looks and their actuality if you know what i mean to get the per to get prince charming to be wrapped in while the other person sleeping beauty was using true love and yeah sleeping beauty was attractive and all of that but sleeping beauty did not want prince charming to be so caught up with only her physical looks to the point where he saw only that. He wanted her, he, excuse me, she wanted him to understand that she loved him. You understand what I'm saying? So these games is how people get other people enraptured and caught up in the first place. That is a part of their game. So you have to be able to navigate through this to understand it. These people that you have been entertaining, that you just feel so magnet magnetically charged towards and you can't stay away from them. But yet, 
when you come around them, they're always blaming you for everything. That's a part of their charm. So then now the Ten of Pentacles is about you have to see it for what it is. That the relationship between you and them is shallow. But also, you have to understand that you, Sagittarius, have other people that are interested in you as well that you can essentially get to know. But if you, Sagittarius, don't decide to give them a try, you're just going to continue to be enraptured with this person that represents this devil right here. The Ten of Pentacles also shows you have a lot of stuff going well for you as well. And then the Wheel of Fortune is about how are you going to be able, are you going to choose to get out? Because the Wheel of Fortune represents you can get out if you want, if you try hard enough, if you dedicate yourself towards actually leaving these people alone, you Sagittarius will be able to get out if you try hard enough, but you're not going to be able to get out if you don't try hard enough and if you and if you and if you continue to allow this person's attractiveness financial attractiveness physical attractiveness to get you caught up in in the games that they want to play with you the 9 of pentacles here represents since that's the case because what i'm seeing here is when it comes to you they're never going to dedicate, and this is the evidence, they're never going to dedicate their full attention to you. They can't do it because the minute that they dedicate their full attention to you, now they're the one ensnared, enraptured, caught up. And that is the trick of the game. And that is the games. And that's part of the games itself. That people who are caught up with this mentality, they can never truly, that's, that's, the, that's the tragedy in it. They cannot be attached to just one person because that's the game that they play. They will, be, they will either get people enraptured into them and into their world and how they think and what they want, or they will get eaten up they will get swallowed under they will get chewed up metaphorically of course themselves right they're, they're they spiritually will lose they will lose their soul so they have to play this game like they can't allow themselves even to get caught up because if they do now it's you got their soul so now you Sagittarius have to understand that you can never be a part of their one true attention, their, 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 their main streamlined source of attention, because once you have that, you got them. And they can allow themselves to have you Sagittarius getting them. Because the way that they see the way that they see it, they see it like servitude. So the the, the so the Magician now is about, so you Sagittarius have to understand that, yes, this person may be attractive to you, but you, again, the world, you have to run away. You have to leave these people alone. You have to do something that is illogical for you to do. You know, you want this person so bad and your attraction to them is illogical also, but you have to do the thing that may end up causing you minimal or a certain amount of discomfort now so that you Sagittarius can actually stay away from those individuals because those people, like I said, that represent this devil, some of them may even be doing witchcraft on you. That is a possibility. Or it may feel like it. Or it may be both. You sense that there's witchcraft because there is. And they're not planning on leaving you alone. And then, like I said before, the world represents you have to learn to run away, run away from this. Because if you don't run away, that's what's going to happen to you. You're going to find yourself in a situation 
where they're gonna they're gonna spin you out into a crazier and more crazier whirlwind and the more you go through this is the worse the situation is going to get for you is the more discomforting it's going to get for you and you can't stop getting yourself caught up with this because you can't break free and it's going to be harder for you to break free the more time you spend so let's clarify the devil the queen of swords Ten of Swords, Ten of Cups, Two of Cups. Yeah, this person wants other people to get caught up with de their agenda and what they want because they have left many a people like this battered up, spiritually, of course where those people cannot, they get those other people to the point where they cannot, they think that they can't live without those people. And then what do they do? They leave them. So some of you Sagittarius really have somebody who is quite devious, you know, really got some stuff going. And then the thing is that the 10 of cups and the two of cups is about, and you'll have to leave them alone because if you do not, right, the more they will they will make it seem like they want to love you. But the reason why they keep having to go over at their, their sibling's house or, or spend time away from you is because of you. You're the one that's threatening them. You're the one that's saying you're going to do something, right, which is a threat. You're the one that's going to, you know, you're the one that's doing this. It's all game because they can't allow you to get close like that because they will become enraptured and hopelessly lost in you and what you want. So let's clarify the Wheel of Fortune now. Five of Swords, Nine of Swords, the Death card, the Three of Cups. Right, you have to, you have to leave them be because you will never actually be able to outplay them because they're crazy. They don't care. The death, the, the death and the three of uh, cups. Yes. Talk to other people. Get in tune with your friends again. If you have some. I'm sure you Sagittarius have some. But go out with other people. Understand that they are not the only per uh, people or person that you should be chasing up after so that's pretty much it comment on the video like the video subscribe to the youtube channel uh smash the subscribe button smash that like button hit the notification bell set that notification bell to all so you can be notified whenever i drop my videos we're at 9500 and change when it comes to subscribers thank you all so much